Hello friends, I'm sorry if my puppy or my cat starts to make any noises during this. I'm gonna try to have them stop, but you never know. Uh, today we're reading about a few different people. This is the Brown Sisters. Rousey, no more. And they are writers. In a cold, bleak house in northern England, there once lived three sisters, Charlotte, Emily, and Anne were often alone and they wrote stories and poems to entertain themselves. One day, Charlotte decided to send her poems to a famous English poet to ask what he thought of them. His response was, I do not like your poems at all. Literature is a man's business. Not very good. Charlotte kept on writing. One night, she found a notebook lying on Emily's desk. Why have you not shown your us your poems before, Charlotte asked. They are beautiful. Emily was furious at her sister reading her private papers without her permission. But once Emily calmed down, Charlotte proposed. Why don't we write a book of poetry together? Emily and Anne agreed. When they finally published their book, it only sold two copies. But they still did not give up, and they kept working in secret, discussing their writing at the dinner table. This time, they each worked on a different novel. When the novels came out, they were hugely successful. People at the time couldn't believe that they had been written by three country girls. So the sisters had to travel to London to prove that they were indeed the authors. Their books have been translated into many different languages and read by millions of people across the world. And it doesn't really know when exactly which girl was born, or possibly they just wanted to just make it all kind of one little thing. They were born 1816, and they died 1855, and they were born in the United Kingdom. And uh, our quote is just from one of the girls, which was Charlotte Bronte. I am not an angel, and I will not be one till I die. I will be myself. Here's their awesome, beautiful art. I hope I get to see you all soon, and I'm so glad that the puppy and the cat did not make too much noise around this time. I hope you're staying safe. Bye-bye.